Welcome back to another Pico Gym Workout Challenge Write-Up video. In this video, we'll be walking through the reverse engineering challenge speeds and feeds. Let's get into it. There's something running on my shop network running at this, but I can't tell what it is. Can you? So let's go ahead and connect into it. All right, and you'll notice that there's a bunch of lines here that just have a bunch of what look like G strings or something, right? If you do a little Googling around, you'll find out that these are just statements in G code. And G code is the most widely used computer numerical control or CNC programming language. And it was developed by MIT and it's used to cut objects on a 3D scale. But these values, you can almost look at as coordinates on a graph because these plot to a graph and that graph is overlaid onto an object, which is then used to cut into or pieces of that object, like I said, on a 3D plane. So all we need to do is copy these into a G-code viewer. Seems simple enough, so let's go ahead and do that. And I'll just grab all of them here. Copy those. And I found one online just by Googling G code viewer. And you can just replace everything that's in here with that. And we can plot it. And you'll notice that it indeed plots a flag for us on a two dimensional scale. Pico CTF numerical control. So let's type that out. Pico CTF numerical Control 749028. All right, let's copy that. Paste it in our flag submission. And there we go. All right, if you enjoyed the video, drop a like and subscribe to the channel to show your support. Turn on post notifications to get regular injections of cyber content directly into your feed. Check out our Patreon, join our Discord, and follow us on Twitter. Links in the description box down below and leave any feedback or questions in the comment section down below. This is Almond Milk. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, world.